<laughs> it's now like burning the shit out of my tongue here. Mm-hmm. Um, John, take over for 30 seconds. <laughs> okay, so delimit. Anyway, delimit is basically an innovation IEX has come up with that protects displayed orders during the very small, tiny moments of the day where they are subject to being picked off from latency arbitrage strategy. So we provide protection to displayed orders, providing new incentive without paying rebates or doing any of that kind of shit that will allow people to feel comfortable posting orders on exchange, provide a new healthy pool of liquidity for other people who are looking to access quotes on exchange. And it's been extremely um, popular and successful thus far. And I think Ronan, you're gonna talk a little bit yeah, about- I'm gonna talk about it because uh, the spice is making you sound smart for once. So <laughs> I'll bring it back to uh, English. So as many of you know, we developed a machine learning signal a number of years ago and we used it for dark. Like when you talk, your tongue gets hotter and hotter. It's fucking crazy. Mm-hmm. Um, we, did, we developed a machine learning signal uh, several years ago for dark trading. It makes it and, sound much more sophisticated when you say yes. machine learning. I mean, and what we received approval now from the SEC is to use it for display trading. So in English is you're in, you're bidding 10, you're willing to buy stock at 10 and IEX predicts that the market's going to tick down to nine. We now have approval to move your trade from 10 to nine, to move you out of the way of trading, what will soon be a stale price. If you talk to any investor and you tell them, hey, do you want to buy a stock at $10 when less than two milliseconds later, you could buy it at nine? Most of them will tell you, no, I'd like to buy the nine kind, please. So So how do we know that the stock is going to move from 10 to nine, Ronan? That's a really, really great question. Our model basically looks at all the other exchanges and sees the quotes crumbling. And as we predict the quotes, as we see the quotes crumbling, we predict that ours, in fact, will try to be accessed. And we just give you the option to move you out of the way. And it's pretty incredible. Well, it sounds to me, Ronan, like if we're making all these predictions that we must be moving people all day long, this must be happening like hours and hours during the day. How do you even know what the what the quote is at any one? Yeah, no, that's that, that's a really great, not great point, John. But uh, <laughs> when when we filed with the SEC to do this, that was that was the the point that brought consternation. Everyone's like, well, now you're going to be fading quotes. People won't be able to trade all day. You'll mm-hmm. keep moving them out of the way. What's remarkable here is on a symbol weighted basis, this signal is only on about five to seven seconds per symbol per day. Holy but, shite, you said five to seven seconds. Yes, those are the five to seven seconds in the trading day you don't want to be trading. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Take another bite of pepper. <laughs> Who the hell knew that milk could... Mm, ah. Oh, fucking hell. Mm, mm. mm. Did you take another bite there too? I took another bite. Give me a break. Mm. They're not tasty. No, they're not. They're really not tasty at all. But the hot sauce is the the lit sauce is very tasty. 